is. Ah, all right, so it's tax season. Do you have anybody doing your taxes or working on your taxes? I don't. I'll make my own. Um, saw on a TikTok that um, TurboTax and all the other taxes are um, the tax companies are uh, they're supposed to have a free filing program for you. And one of the, I don't know if you guys have heard, but TurboTax is getting sued because what they do is they trick you into thinking you're doing a free filing service, but you're not. You end up falling into all these hidden buttons and so on and so forth. They hide the no button or cancel button. So that way you have to pay for the TurboTax service. I've seen it firsthand. You guys who use TurboTax have seen it firsthand. They try to trick you, like, and they're really good at it too. They try to trick you into getting um, you to pay for their program. Now, what I've done was for a simple tax form that I've made um, for my wife, I actually call them. And tell them, hey, this is only one W-2 form. You said it's supposed to be free. I'm getting charged. And they actually give me a code to make it free. Me, on the other hand, my, my taxes are complicated. So I would have to pay. Anyway, <sighs> it is now 11 p.m. or 11.20 p.m. And... Um, we are going into nighttime mode, which usually that happens when my eye starts to tear up. My body is like, put me to sleep already. But I really want to do this and post this up for you guys. For, you know, that one person that subscribed to my channel. Thanks, dude. And, um... Alright, let's get to watching the guardians of the galaxy trailer just so we can see if we can figure out who's going to die in it now there is another um another what was it, what was it? um another tiktok that um, mentions that you can tell when someone's going to die when the Guardians of the Galaxy logo color changes. So he actually pinpoints that this specific color killed this character and this specific color killed this character. So the logo for the Guardians of the Galaxy is, is brown. Brown or yellow? It looks more like yellow. Who the hell is yellow? So that's something to think about. All right, so I'm going to rewind. Let's get this going. Uh, give me a second. Yellow. Who's in that yellow? 
or orange. So Jax is shot right in the chest. And I think she... Oh, man. Who's dead? Who is that? He's gonna start hitting on the sister. That's kind of fucked up. Um, so Star Lord might die. Oh. Well, I know Jax is gone. I mean, come on, the actor is like fifty something years old. He can't keep up with the the gym. That and there was another trailer of him already really wanting to do um, Gears of War. Loved that game. Uh, <sighs> so, if he could pull that off, that would be pretty hot. And he wouldn't have to be shirtless all the time with Gears of War. They're always wearing body armor. Hmm. So we know Jax is gone. Huh. What do you guys think? If Jax is obviously gone, maybe... Uh, Star-Lord is too. He can't keep going on doing the same shows. I mean, uh, I mean, he, he probably could pull out one more, one more Thor. What's his name? Hemsworth said that he would keep doing Thor as long as the character keeps growing. But I don't know if you noticed, but uh, he was doing this live channel, and he mentions that, and he ends up mentioning that. Uh, That he has, they, they did a, a gene thing to check his DNA and it finds out that he has, or the Parkinson's I think it was, or dementia or something like that. So now he wants to actually end the Thor contract so that way he can spend time, more time with his family. So that's, that's going to be interesting. Yeah. So now, let me introduce you to our new anime show we will probably take a good laugh at, if it's bad. Um, um, this is called... Avengers. Avengers the anime. Uh, let's see what the intro looks like. I don't know. Like, uh, this is obviously in the 80s because you could tell the artwork. Yeah, let me lower this a bit. Oh, the sound already sounds bad. Um, yeah, the, uh, yeah, see spiky hair, spiky hair. 
There's always a glow or something. The art style is definitely 80s. Spiky hair, spiky hair. Badass look. Wind for no reason. More badass look with spiky hair. Big eyes. Glowing. All right. It's not that serious, girl. Calm down. All right. Let me fast forward. All right. I like the details so far. And they're on some type of planet. It's not Earth. So this actually might be interesting to watch. <sighs> All right. As this plays out in the eighties, they always have they they have this. They always have this in the eighties, but they also have like that slow motion panning overview of what they're going to be moving into the next scene for. The goddess Westa. Okay, so I'm gonna go here. Oh, um, before I do anything, um, this show is brought to you by Drawline Studios. Uh, we do uh, wedding photography and videography, and we have a photo booth. We have a drone. We have a DJ that works with us. Um, you can take, go online to www.drawlinestudios.com and you can actually take a look. Oops, sorry. You can actually take a look at, there you go, um, the website. And all decked out, most of it by me, web designer. Thank you very much. Uh, for me, I do photography, but I also do website designing. Um, I do website hosting, I do graphic design, printing, so on and so forth. Um, but I like to work with my brother over the weekends because it's cool to hang out, you know, brother, brotherly love. And um, you can check out our services going through the navigation. You can also see our gallery, samples of our work. And um, I set up a blog for him and he's trying to work with the blog and the blog is supposed to show the locations that we worked, uh, what we think about it, um, the clients, kind of like a small review of the whole project. And, uh, and then you get to see samples obviously of the work right there, including maybe some video links. Um, then over here, you can just contact us. Uh, you fill out a nice little form and we do have days that are open. Uh, we do have days that are filled in by either the DJ or us already. Uh, we like to team up and work with other DJs or uh, party planners to help fill in our weekends. And then Monday through Friday, we do the graphic and web design. No, we do the photo editing and the video editing of the weddings we did in our previous weekend all right so if you're interested you can call at 908-313-2326 leave a message for uh, my brother nelson malta uh or you can go online www.drawlinestudios.com and then take a look at our services right there but if you really want to get prices you have to contact us either through the website on phone number or at joinline studios at gmail.com. Okay, so, or you contact us through Facebook. Okay, uh, 
text messaging, uh, I'm sorry, Facebook messaging, same thing, a little slow respond. Actually, we do a lot of our advertisements through Facebook. And then from there, we communicate through Facebook Messenger on what the procedure is. You know, we set up a meeting, we do a Zoom link, and then we talk about the steps that's going to happen in that day. All right. Yes, my advertising skills are pretty far up there. Anyway, let's go back here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to get rid of this screen. And we're going to go sh straight to my work. So I'm going to open this up. And I'm going to move this over here. So that way I can see what the hell is going on. And then I'm going to keep watching this show because there's always something funny on these 80s shows that's, that's good to make fun of. Now, obviously, if you want to watch Avengers, the anime, um, go figure it out yourself. Hmm. <sighs> Like it's not a freebie thing. You still, I still copyright it. Like you still have to, even though it's in the '80s, you still have to um, go to Crunchyroll or Funimation or wherever you get your anime from and watch it from there. Avengers anime, the anime. All right. And I technically just showed you the intro, so you should easily be able to find it. Now, if I can get this picture done, I could probably get to the next picture to draw. Ooh, girl with legs. Pretty sure that was a glitch. Maybe. Anyway. Alright, so. Now what I'm trying to do is I'm going to try to keep going with this artwork here. And I basically have... Some of it, most of it gone, done, but now the hair is going to be the most difficult. I usually put a lot of details in the hair, and um, that's going to be, I think, the most stressful out of trying to complete this. Because I have a certain way or style of doing the hair, and I haven't mastered it yet on the digital board. Obviously, in the 80s, they used to do one naked scene just so they could get people interested in the show. Water drop. Boob with scar. Three robots. Three robot girls. Explosion. Oh. I always hated that about the eighties. They would always like start the scene off and the scene was decent and then they would say something that makes no sense. Anyway, um, hmm. I can already tell you that I don't like the lips. Of course. 
So she decided to break three expensive robots. Really? I would have literally told this little bastard freaking. Ugh. Really? One of those? <sighs> they over exaggerate how badass the person is. Like, she basically ruined three very expensive machines. If I was that guy, I would have told her to go screw herself and cough up the money. Right. I'm not happy with the lips. And the problem is that the way that the eyes are... The lips wasn't, is not angled the way that it should be. So I need to come here, let's see if I can somehow. She's a pain in the ass. I just want to move the bottom lip up. Take her away and kill her. Okay. Put one of those like that. Yes, meh. Show me the way. We're going to... What? We're not doing that. Stop doing that. That dog. I think that could have done it. No. It needs to be higher. God oh, damn it. Um What? Alright. Oh, hold on. Let's let's rewind for a minute. So they're in a fight. Come on. Really? You just do a whole flip and you can tie him up like that without breaking your own arms? Right, let me watch that again. Stops him. For some particular reason, he doesn't want to do anything but stand there and look in deep into his eyes. Okay. And he got him like that.
and I don't know. I don't, I don't think that's something that could happen in real life. You can't just do a flip and, you know, with his arms. Mm, Alright, whatever. Let's, see. Let's move this up a little bit more. This time. And then she beats up three more robots for no particular reason. Okay. I see a storm. Shut up. She broke on it all hell, god damn it. That looks a lot better. Yeah, I think that looks a lot better. Um, what I do also think, though, is that I should bring this part down just a tad bit more. Maybe I should do that? Let's find out. I really wish it would stop doing that. Let me see. Uh, let's go to app settings. Uh, input, input, touch, fingers, erase refresh. It doesn't screw this up for me. I'm gonna bring this down a little bit. Tie my shoelaces. All right, I think that's actually a whole lot better. Uh, okay, so we have that.
All right. Now for the hair. This is the going to be the interesting part here. There he is. Interesting. Hair. Okay, so we're going to do hair. New. You don't say. Why do you need to know that? Mm. All right, let's see. <laughs> mm. It's made a little bit of a struggle to Broken? Is it possible? Kill me, weenie. That's annoying. Well, what the? Dude, you're talking while you're getting knocked out. I told you to try and kill me. Like, you only gave him, like, like a second to freaking respond. Touch of death? Yes. Because for some particular reason, he warrants an answer.
<sighs> you just left with the kid? Now oh, this is gonna be tough. I'm not sure about this show. <sighs> oh, man. I'm just, I'm just going to fast forward it because it sounds horrible. I don't like the intro. The intro just sounds god awful. Um, let's see. Now, instead of the hair, let's, let's just go straight to the eyes. I see. Have it, you. All right, we're gonna go. Can it though?
you don't say. Okay. <laughs> Mm, not bad. No, she's not. Bitten off more than you can chew. What? Well, oh. thought I was going to go in a different direction right there. Miss Layla, you're a pain in the ass. Just, I'm just trying to stay up. Actually, no, I'm going to keep it short. And I'm going to go to sleep. I am tired. All right, I'm going to file save this. Uh...
Pew. Change touch. Oh yeah. Which is you. So this is the straight all. This is supposed to be the robot that's supposed to take straight dolls and kill them. And this person is an idiot, even though it's a doll. Mm. Mm. Layla. That all this girl says is shut up. What do you care? Uh, all right, that's it for this. Um, I will see you guys hopefully tomorrow, and have a good night. Sleep well. Stay warm.